everybody. It's Coach Jane from the First Tee in North Florida, and I am here to share a great snowman story with you today. Even though we don't get any snow here in Florida, I just thought it would be fun to read this snowman book. It's called All You Need for a Snowman by Alice Shirtle, and it's illustrated by Barbara Lavalle. One small snowflake fluttering down. That's all you need for a snowman, except two more snowflakes, three flakes, four, five, six, seven thousand, eight million more. Billions of snowflakes piled in a mound. Pat them and pack them and roll them around into one big ball. And that's all. One big, cold, well-rolled snowflake ball. That's all you need for a snowman, except for a middle-sized ball and a small one. On top of that, you need a hat, a short, flat hat, or a tall one. Three hand-packed, triple-stacked balls of snow, hat on top where a hat should go. That's all you need for a snowman, except for a couple of bottle caps, round and flat, stick them under a snowman's hat. Surprise! Snowman's eyes. That's all you need for a snowman's face. But, what's in the middle? An empty space. That's the place where the carrot goes, if a carrot is the snowman's nose. What about clothes? Walnut buttons, five in a row, belt in the middle, boots below. Big wool scarf, broom to hold mittens in case his hands get cold, earmuffs, fanny pack, something to read. That's absolutely all you need for a snowman. And here he is. Beautiful snowman. Uh-oh! Look in the sky again. One small snowflake falling. Then... Soft white snowflakes filling the sky, floating down everywhere, piling up high. And that's all you need for a snowman's friend. The end. I hope you enjoyed my snowman story today. Have a great day. See you next time.